Hello and welcome to our GeoGuessr Daily Challenge. How are you today, Wendy? I'm good, thanks, darling. Much nicer than I've been lately. <laughs> well, that's good. Boss Man Ken's first and Blocko's second. That's good. Now, um, is that microphone in the right position so it's I can fine to annoy hear. JG? Because I'm yeah. going to hate not upset him. Um, we have... <laughs> You'd hate for um, JG to enjoy the yeah, video. Yeah, that's exactly right. Because I think he watches it... Oh, that's vaguely Spanish, but with a... Um, I think it's Spanish. If there having, was an accent, it could have been both Portuguese. Having, oh, did I bring the can? We're it's both there. having a... A uh, yeah, Bundaberg ginger beer. Yeah. Shared one. Um, hmm, tortillas, panchos, who was? It sounds fruta, whiskey, yeah. lina, hamburg, hamburguesia. I want you to read that one again. Pavellos. I don't know how you say it. Huevos. Huevos. <laughs> okay, so we're in suburbia. It's got a little corner shop. Yeah. There's no curb and channeling and a Mercedes truck. And a very dodgy looking guy down the street. Um, Have they got spikes on the poles? So it's a bit of a... You know, not so they do have they do spikes. area, but they're not like South Africa level that gates. No, no, but you know, it's certainly not. Come visit me. I want you to visit, yeah. jump the fence. I don't think many places have they're, fences. They're, no, they're high fences with spikes, so yeah. you can't jump. Them. And they've got security companies listed. Yeah. So, but do you know many places where they go? Oh, come on, jump the fence, join well, us. Have you seen Willie, our dog, <laughs> Eddie? Tradesman, Wil Wilson's ridiculous. He comes on the front veranda, and anybody that crosses our street. From the corner of the church down to the roundabout, he barks his head off saying, get off my street. Oh, you're here. But if they walk up the driveway and into the ramp, he goes, hi, I'm Wilson. Maybe Come he's, and party. Maybe he's barking to the people across the street. Come visit. Mm -hmm. We're open. He's ridiculous. <laughs> and and when any dog or horse or Joy pig Huyger. comes on TV and he barks at them, I go, get him, sick him. Go, Willie. Go do it. Sub agent. It, it gives him a small thrill. You know what I'm he'd talking like. Talking about you, Willie. You know what he'd go off at if he lived only, in Hunter and Vinny's house. The only thing he barks at is if you come to the top floor where he, he and my bedroom is. Yeah. So Wilson does. Even my husband, if Michael's walking up the stairs, sometimes he just realizes Michael. And he'll bark at him. He yeah. Doesn't, doesn't like people. Oh, Colonna. C O L O N. Vinny and Hannah's house in what, London. Are we looking for that? I'm looking on the maps for information. Uruguay. Good and Colonna. Kuska. Terminal Cologne. Cologne. Okay. Or Kutska. Bigger. Bigger. Look at look some other places. Cologne Centro. Terminal. So it's oh, Cologne yeah. Centro. Prada to, that's where that's going to. Yeah. So it's not there. It's just so we're near there. These streets are pretty. I mean, you can get a 148 Ashgrove to Inogra bus. That I used to catch into the city when I was in the in Brisbane. Yeah, and it goes probably thirty kilometres from what's ending to end. Ashgrove is nowhere near where. Yeah, it was not. It was Grange. We used to go Grange to Ashgrove, and it was the one forty six. Let's go back and forth, back and forth. I don't see any street names. We're on the corner near a park, so let's put us there. Mm. I got the wrong park, but I'm the closest out of anyone. Unbelievable, David. Yeah. Um. So. Yes. Go on. Uh, Hannah and Vinny's house. We have a big dumpster so, there. Don't say go. <laughs> okay, no, I'm talking about the dumpster at Hannah and Vinny's house in England or in, um, in England, Australia. In England. Yeah, yeah. Wilson would love it there. Uh, every few days they have a horseback policeman oh, you walk showed past. me. Yeah. Yes. Okay, that's Russian. We're bars. You know, no, look at the top of Ukrainian writing. No, we are in. Serbia. No. Or well, that one. The Where is it? Yeah, Kyrgyzstan. What is it hiding? Kyrgyzstan. 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 We're in Bishkek somewhere. Oh, just... Look for oh, yeah, we'll look around more, yeah. but I think we're in Bishkek. See, that says, welcome to the 2015 gathering of Bishkeki and Bishkeks. We can't read anything I don't know why we try to read that anyway. They have a street name? Oh, since no. I've got up and had a drink, I'm feeling hungry. I hope Riley brings crap food, which he shouldn't. But yeah. He will. She got some, <laughs> I hope he brings more crap food as you eat the salt and vinegar chips he left behind. Mm. <laughs> three, uh, three day old stale ones. Oh, they're fine. Um, you can get your suspension. Oh, no, your um, frame, you can your battery, charge. your motor, your electric motor, your suspension, and your tyres. Where do you, I just dropped chips on the floor. Willie, where do you think I can get Andrew's wheel old wheelchairs that are downstairs? The battery on them fixed without having to go to the expensive battery man and air board. You know, if we go to one of those electric wheelchair places, you know, just the ones like the old people have, you know, those ones. Yeah, maybe you could go to um, what's it called? Uh, what are they? What's that shop called? Battery. Dylan's brother used battery to work there. World? Battery World. What to have the big ones? That... 
Just Honestly, just... they could just tell you if it's broken or not, or work out what's wrong with it. Okay. We need it for um. Well, for we, we don't need it. I talked to Riley and Abby, the choreographer. Mm -hmm. We're probably just going to use a hand wheelchair because the electric ones are too big and there's not too much backstage room in that place, oh, especially with all our it, set. But it looks fun. It does look very fun, but it's easy to well, just have I'm one of the... Well, I'm not going to go and fix them then. Yeah, don't fix so them. So we just use the red one. We'll just use a little red one, yeah. Okay. It'll oh, still... That's easy. You know what idea I did have, but... Mm -hmm. Um... She's meant to have broken every bone in her body. I was going to see if we could... Well, that's why you can't... You don't need an electric one because you've got to move to one hand. She can have one person, someone pushing her around. Mm. Um, She's meant to have broken every bone in her body. Yeah. I was going to go to Dad and see if we can get some plaster stuff. Oh, yeah. We could plaster her arms and legs, but then cut them off and then just make them oh. retachable plasters. That is... That's a huge job. It is a huge job, but it would be cool. Because you know the drill... The special saw that they use, yeah. Yeah, it's it's actually it's quite hard to do. I don't think Daddy's going to let you do that. Oh, Dad, trust me, I'm I'm an expert, Doctor. <laughs> Shit, it wasn't Bishkek, it was Usk. I've Us Us. Uh oh. What have you done? Wrong country. No, I wanted to quick Google. Um, Geo Guesser new footage. Oh. <laughs> I think that's a new country. I created a version of Geo Guesser with a real video. Ah, oh, it doesn't tell us. Oh wait, if if I look up this one, Google. Maps recent countries added because I think I heard that that country was coming recently. Oosh. Come on. <laughs> Nepal shit cam. <laughs> also, when Kazakhstan dropped, no one expected it. Well, basically. How long ago was that? Every time we've had that, I swear we've been in Kyrgyzstan. Yeah. And, but what, what country is it? Oh, don't worry. Um, that whole Google, everyone would have been laughing at me. Why? It's still Kyrgyzstan, it's just it curves around underneath. Okay. I thought that might have been Kazakhstan. <laughs> to be fair, I think I heard there was new footage in one of these countries. That could be new footage. As if he... But it's not a new country. Because he spends all of his spare time geo-guessing um, research. No, I, thought, I get that the occasional picture comes up. <laughs> okay, okay. Um, it was someone going new field, DLC drops. We're in a field. We've got wildflowers and we've got wind farms at the back. Yeah. I don't even think it's Europe. Unless it's down in Spain. Oh, it could be Spain. What does this one say? That, that, that sign right here. Right, right, there. We're in Italy. Arty funerals. Arty yeah. funerals. Arty men of de... Why is he wearing a do-rag? You could call Fabio. You could call Riccardo. Fabio, Riccardo, <laughs> I pitre. Oh, it's a marble shop. Yeah. Funeralia. You know what I really have been watching a lot of TikTok videos on that I want to try? Yeah. Stone carving. Where? If you don't, don't do it at this desk, it's fine. You've got to do it downstairs in the workshop. And you won't do that because it's 30 degrees here now and you won't go back to the workshop until next March. Yeah. Can <laughs> I go? Can I do it in Dad's air-conditioned bedroom downstairs? No! <laughs> These, it's all covered in costumes at the moment. Poor but Daddy. stone carving looks really cool. Oh, God, David. I've seen people do it. They're really good at it. To start with wood or something. No, but wood carving's not chipping. Wood carving, hey. you've got to... You know what you know watching. That's called Whittling. You, you know, I've been watching all these eighties movies for Heather's. Yeah. I actually saw oh, I think we've been in the square before. Um Euro? Italian flag in the middle. Oh, you already said it was really Yeah. Um Okay, you just do that and I'll just talk to you. You tell us about um, the thing you were yes, talking about. I was watching this um eighties movie. I think it was Pretty in Pink or one of those ones. Anyhow, yeah. one of the John Hughesman's. And the girl had a pineapple print shirt on. You know like the pineapple print shirt I've got? Yep. So I reckon I should bring that to the next costume. <laughs> <laughs> I was waiting for um the you know the dress I brought because we had to we had to be dressed up for Sunday because um because we had sponsors coming. There's already on their you their Instagram page that they came to a thing. Yeah, they've got a video of it. It's up there. That's good. I showed I um showing Kathleen who came and hopefully came that sells up. some tickets. Not much point having them there if it doesn't sell tickets. Anyhow, so I um I had my brand new beautifully Tanya linen. Lemon's dress on the end of the um, costume rack because it was too hot to wear it until the posh people came. <laughs> and I was waiting for one person who doesn't like my costume choices to come in and go, well, what's that going on? <laughs> going on, me. It's mine. I'm wearing it today. <laughs> I didn't get too excited to react. How disappointing. <laughs> Stop trying to agitate people. I'm not even trying to agitate people. I told you one of the um the two guys told me it looked I looked really nice in it. Piano. Sedimente productive. Quiet industrial state. Oh, exactly what that is. Allen Street up the road. 
It's a quiet industrial estate. Piano. Forte. Don't those words ca counteract each other? Doesn't forte mean loud? Yes. So my oh, shit, David. Fuck me. I was so ready to go, oh, my God, I'm a genius. Look at this. I found a church sign that said San Giovanni, and I found a town yeah, called San David, Giovanni. David, David. Yeah. What does Giovanni stand for in Italy? Probably something. John. John. St. John's Church. Yeah, well, I found St. John's Town. Because your father said to me when I asked him years ago when we were only first dating, What's his middle name? And he told me it was Michael Giovanni Hayes <laughs> because his middle name's John. I can't believe I found the same. David, there's going to be St. John's all over everywhere. I know, but still, I'm very annoyed that there I found an, one it wasn't There was right. an apostle called John, and then there was also... Look, there it is. The residence of St. John. Residentia um, say a Giovanni. You know how you say piano forte, don't they cancel each other out? Yeah. They do. The reason the piano is called a piano forte mm. is the only instrument before it, the harpsichord... When you click the key, it would make the same volume noise every time. Oh. But a piano could be make... soft and oh, loud, yeah. oh. which is why they named oh, after Australia. it. Australia, I think so too. Yeah. Oh, don't on the verge for school days. Oh, oh, we got a school. Come We're on. Western Australia. Okay, okay. No, the Thornley Senior High School students return on the thirtieth of April. Oh, it's a Banksia tree. Why do you think it's Western Australia? I found Thornley. Oh, that's not like fun. Oh. <laughs> I <laughs> found no help. What's do you want some help? help? Why no. it's yeah, okay, tell me why it's Western Australia. Yellow poles. Oh, okay. Yeah. So it was some deep and meaningful thing. No. no, it was just yellow poles. Yeah. Not looking at the plants or the... <laughs> Thornley without a Y. South Thornley. Independent Thornley's... public school. So what does that mean? They're independent. So that means they're private wankers. Independent. They might get funding from the government, but they don't have to stick to private Every school. Every school gets funding. Private schools get heaps more funding than public schools because they're so much more... Annoying, and most of the politicians went to private schools. <laughs> true. It's no, true. it is exactly true. Can I have some of yours because I've drunk all mine? <laughs> she asked to split one with me. Oh, look, the Perth Hindu Temple. That's cool. It's not going to help you, Thornley. What if we want Thornley Senior High School? Yeah, no, I'm looking. With the Banksia for its... Um... I'll take my drink back and put it further <laughs> away because I was looking forward it's to that your, after the video. The, well, let's look at some streets. Thornley Football Club. You want to look for streets? No, we don't know a street. We're on a big street, so let's yeah, look for a street. <laughs> go on, go on. Let's get a, let's get five thousand in in um. Oh, oh, what Ovens is... Street, Ovens Road. Yep, Maybe. Ovens Road. Oven, uh, spelled O V E N. -S. Yeah, spelled correctly. Okay, Ovens. Oh yeah. Um. Hume Road. Yayo Road. Spring Coop. Thorny Spring. It can't be too many high schools. When does Thorny technically end? That goes all the way up here. Forest Lakes Shopping Centre. We have a Forest Lakes in... Um, we have Forest Glen, don't we? No, Forest Lakes down in, Queen, in Brisbane, near Brisbane, it's Forest Lakes. You're going too far, I think, now. I know, but I saw something. Evans? Yeah. Wa Wa Wharton Road, Forest Lakes Drive. I don't think it's in Forest Lakes. It's not Forest Lakes, so you need to get away from Forest Lakes and go back. I want to see what bus stop you are. Yeah, I thought it could help. 212 bus stop number 2. Your ad here. So there's a big park across. That's a good point. Let's look for a park. No. Oh, Storm Thornley School. Go down. Go, I saw it. Down, down. Thornley. I saw something. Senior. Ovens Road. Ovens Road. So we started like slightly that way. Yeah, but make sure you're getting in line. Do you load a rhyme? We don't want to get this wrong. We don't want to run out of time. 11 seconds. 10. 9. I'm doing a righty. 8. 7. Six. That says five. kiss and drive. Yeah, drop and drop and you yeah, kiss and drop. Kiss and then take off. There you go, Yay! 5, Woo! We're the closest. Yep, <laughs> only people to get it so far. Really? Let's get the five thousand. Yeah, it wasn't hard. No, it wasn't. We got lucky. I didn't even know where Thorny was. I just got lucky finding it. Um, are they? It's a crepe myrtle, I think. No. This could be a berg. Condon's guard. Oh, so Lib B H B S H. Her offer bigger here. Her, oh, where, oh, so we Denmark. There were some or, German people at trivia today. Yes, and I learned just were how. They, were they there for the um for the zoo? I don't know. I didn't ask, but probably I didn't. I don't think I um. Bleh, what's where? I learned how little German I've properly learned because they did not understand my German. <laughs> what did they say? Well, they were nice about it. 
The name English is probably perfect. I said Recknung, which I thought meant menu, but it meant the check. And they both oh. thought I was coming up to them saying, do you want the check yet? Even though they just sat down. Oh my God. <laughs> and I, they, I, they did not know the word trivia when I said, we're just playing trivia. Oh, and they they joined in. They probably won. Oh no, they didn't join in. They couldn't understand enough English for oh. to join in. But they probably could. Oh, they probably could have. They just didn't want to. And it was to. just buzzer. Yeah. It's probably because they're German. They wanted to win. They wanted to only do something that they knew they were going to win. No, I think they just wanted to enjoy their dinner. <laughs> were they young with kids? No, no. They probably were here for going to the zoo. Um, so where David does trivia is near Australia Zoo, which is the huge, what's his name? Steve Irwin Zoo. Yeah, Steve, very famous worldwide zoo. Yeah, and Steve Irwin had TV shows. So it's probably one of the most famous zoos on earth. No, Taronga Park Zoo is a much nicer zoo. <laughs> I said famous, not nice. Yeah, We went to the Taronga Park Zoo when David was little, probably about four or five, and Andrew yeah. was little in his wheelchair. And you get off, you go by ferry. And we got off the ferry, and the guy that was oh, well done, David. No, not well done. That was Denmark. We got off, and I the did guy, that because I want to Google this. The guy saw Andrew in the wheelchair. The guy directing everybody off the ferry because there was about two hundred people getting off the ferry at once. And he said, "Come with me." And he took us over to a lift. He said, oh, "And you're in." And I said, "We haven't paid." And he said, "You don't have to pay." We got Andrew in a wheelchair. <laughs> we got him. All of us, Peter, uh, and we had um, what's the name? Which was the carer then? Brittany. No, way back earlier than that. Jessica. No. Earlier, the first one. Jessica was the first one. No. Where are you for Jessica? Brittany? No. Um, Gerda's store. Wasn't that Jessica? No, Jessica was... Jessica was... Jessica was the one that came to Sydney with us. That, no, it wasn't Jessica that came to Sydney. Oh, I can't think of her name for a minute. My brain's yeah, gone. She became a teacher. She started working for us when she was 14. And she told me after I had Peter that I wasn't having any more children. <laughs> she could only look after three. She worked every Saturday for us. I wanted to prove you wrong that... What's her name? Jody. Jody. It was Jody, yeah. Peter called her... Peter used to call um, Michael jo Dadams and he used to call Jody Jodams. <laughs> Dadams and Jodams. I wanted to prove to you... There we are. Australia Zoo is number seven on this one. Oh, 50 best, best zoos, zoos in, the in the world. And what's Taronga Park? Taronga was on all the other lists I found. I tried to find a list that would prove you wrong. <laughs> so he had to actually... Taronga had to hunt Park for it. is... It's, it's also because it's actually on the... Um, there it is, what, number 20. Yeah. Because look at the view. See, it's right on the most yeah. beautiful position. Every photo you've got, you've got the giraffes. We've got a great photo of you with you and Andrew next to the giraffes and then the harbour behind. I should actually show you the photos of that trip and remind you of it. Hey, I remember it. Do you? No. We also went to the Dubbo Zoo on the way there. I actually do remember a trip where we went to Susan's. Oh, no, we went to, no, we went to the Dubbo Zoo and we went down to see the dish. We, we came to Canberra. But we're still the best person on the Australia round. Well oh, no, apart done. from Simon C, who did very well. Simon got Six a perfect metres? two. Six metres? And what did we get? How many metres? 15 metres. Oh, Simon C, you Simon's beat us. so much closer. He must have had a blowout. When did he have a blowout? Yeah, he must have blown out on something else. You're right. Okay. Wendy, stop talking. Let David get on with this yeah. thing. Connections. King Kong. Ha, ha. Beep. King Kong. So, ha, ha, and beep, beep, and ding, dong. King Kong's a monkey. George is a monkey. Bubbles is the name of a monkey. Isn't Yo-yo? No. I think there's a Coco's monkey probably too. Uh, no, it's just one. I think you mucked that up. Oh, my God. He Famous got primates. Well, and it was the purple. Uh, there's a TV show called genius. The 100 or something. Mm -hmm. oh, it's not called that. That um, Pointless. Yeah. No, I know your drink's empty. <laughs> Here, you want to smell my sugar-free sun kiss? Yuck. No, I want, um, I want your ginger beer. Yeah, go on. There's a show called Pointless that Hannah and Vinny showed you me. Have to, I know, I've seen it. You have to lose points on purpose. or you have to. No, you have to not lose the most by guessing things that... Are obscure. That yeah. other people won't, yeah. But I watched it. It is the slowest paced show I've ever seen. They spend yeah. so much time talking to the fucking contestants. I, know, it's I don't so give annoying. a point to show that to But also, I've bet the person right in this could... All of those were in the Pointless episode we watched. <laughs> I bet they could steal some good content from Pointless. So tell me what skirt is without the eye. Skirt? I wonder if it's a... um. Skirt, vroom, purr... And hoot. And no, beep, beep. Uh, onomatopoeia sounds of a car. Well done. Oh, car oh, onomatopoeia. Oh, well done, David. You're a genius. Ding dong. Ding dong. What's that song in um the Icelandic... You know, the slandic um, Eurovision. Ya, ya, ding dong. Ya, ya, ding dong, yeah. <laughs> Yuck. That's a house. Dodos are extinct. Is that how you spell dodo? It is, yeah. Yahoo's a, isn't Yahoo a magazine as well as a saying, a, a call out to people? 
Yeah. Isn't it a Yahoo magazine? That one. No, I, I was trying that. to think because you can go whoop Yahoo hoot and ha ha. Yeah, ha ha's when you laugh. I tried that already, and it said it was one away. This ding dong. What are you? You keep getting one away. How are you doing that? David, what are you doing? I don't know what I was doing. Uh, I had a thought here. Yuck. Is that yak with a... Yuk. 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 Yuk is Y-A-K. Yuk. Ding dong. Doo doo. It's not dodo. Dodo. Yahoo, Well, they're definitely. Whoop, Yahoo, and Hoot are definite. No, but it said one away with this. Yeah. And with this. I think. So, so those two are wrong. We have to choose one out of these. Those can still all be right, and those two be wrong, and it can be one of those. You're right, but I think I'm getting confused by what was one away. <laughs> um, the, the one I'm looking at yuck for is if you change the U to an A, you get yak. Yeah, but it's not yak, it's yuck. But I was thinking there could be like one change the I'll change one letter, but I can't see any others. Um, Come on, just just jump. Okay, Yahoo, no whoop hoot, ha ha, and no, it's not. It's going to be whoop hoot and Yahoo, and then something else. And yo yo. A ding dong, a dodo, a, do a, a Yahoo, or a yo yo. So Yahoo wasn't the chair; it was an idiot. idiot. Sounds of laughter, ha ha, hoot, whoop, and a yuck. I've never heard of yuck being like, a yuck, huh, 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 I don't know. And that was a blue. Yeah. Definitely, in this case, famous primates should have been one of the harder. Um, like, I think that one's one of the hardest they ones. They should have done the Korean ha ha. What they do is they, they do They just, they have a sim it's it's a a F, symbol. It's a F-U or something. It looks like yeah. a F-U symbol. And that's their ha ha symbol. Anyway. Okay, I'm off now. Bye. Bye.